Hi guys and welcome to another episode of Kabir Considers. In this video, I'm going to react to 9-11 as it happened. Now, this is going to be almost surreal. It probably will be quite surreal, to be honest. You know, watching people go about their lives, because I imagine it's going to be, it's going to have footage of just before and then during. So people going about their lives, you know, walking around in New York, just living and then bang, the planes hit the buildings. How do you respond? How do you react to that? I, if, if I was there, I would be in complete shock. I'd think, am I dreaming right now? I'd have to try and wake myself up because to see a jumbo jet crash into a building, a skyscraper, it's not something you see. It's just, it's some, it's, it doesn't happen. So it's gonna be, it's gonna be, it's gonna be incredible watching this to be honest and uh, yeah. I just hope that, you know, anyone that's uh, that lost people, just, it's just, I don't know what to say, you know, sorry for your loss. It's gonna be, uh, let, let, let's get to it. Mm. News footage and amateur video. It contained scenes and language that may disturb some. Eight forty six. So was that the plane? Oh, wow. Shit. Wow. Oh, what the hell was God. that? It sounded like a plane crash. Oh my God. Hey, Beth. Well, what is that? Something somebody hit uh, the World Trade Center or the. It's a trade center. The World trade, trade center. center. Unreal. Yeah. Unreal. This just in, you're just looking at we have a breaking news story very to tell you about. Watch watch out there. That is the know, World Trade we Center, and we have just unconfirmed reports this morning. To an explosion at as we come on now, we have yeah. serious news. I remember at school hearing the teachers talk about it when it, when this happened. I, I remember quite vividly, actually. The major and very tragic event for the world. It's incredible. A plane crash into the World Trade Center. Terrible. I just heard a loud boom. You, you did? Was didn't it a plane? It, didn't it claim like 4,000 people? There were 4,000 lives lost. Something like that. That's what I was thinking. It was a terrorist attack. Immediately, there's speculation or cause for concern. This is the World Trade Center that was the center of a terrorist bombing right. some years ago. So the questions have to be asked, was this a purely an accident or could this have been an intentional act? But either way, extensive damage changed the world forever, honestly. It really did. What's this other jet doing? What's what this other jet Oh my god, another one. Here we go. Holy fuck! Wow! Oh my god, I have never seen that before. Oh my god. It went oh right in. Looks like six, seven floors were taken out. And there's more oh, there's, explosions oh, right now. Oh hold on, people are running. Wait, so hold, hold on. on just a moment. We've got an explosion inside. The oh, building's that... exploding right now. You got people running up the street. Okay. Oh, I'll tell you what's going on. Right. Oh my God! Another oh, plane has just God. hit. It hit another building. Oh. Flew right into the middle of it. This Explosion. My right, God! It's right in the middle of the building. Just look at that huge plume. Oh my God! All the debris falling. Open your book up to lesson sixty on page one fifty-three. Wow, so that's President Bush hearing about it. This is when he first heard. Wow, look at him processing it. This is crazy. Mom, another plane just crashed into other World Trade Center. Another plane hit it. A jet, a jumbo jet. I'm so scared. I'm leaving. No, no, don't, don't make it. You can't. Bye. I love you. I don't blame her for being scared, to be honest, because you're thinking, are there more planes? You have some videotape oh. just goes of the right second plane, there. and you can oh. see it there. Oh. Where? Oh. I didn't see it. Here, oh, whoa. Oh, oh, my this God. is crazy. We We're under attack. Going into and buildings. And from our vantage point, yeah, clearly difficult to tell. We're under uh, attack. What type of plane that is, but it's a horrific scene. That's and oh All right, we've just been told God. also, Michael, sorry, the New York Stock Exchange is, is being evacuated, as is, I'm sure, much of yeah. Wall Street, if not all of it, as, as much as possible. But the New York I mean, sh you, 
you would think that anywhere where there's a lot of people, you would evacuate immediately. Because are there more planes? Are there bombs? Are there, you know, are there other horrific things on the way? Stock exchange has suspended trading for the moment. It's war. Uh, today, we've had a national tragedy. Uh, two airplanes have crashed into the World Trade Center in an apparent terrorist attack on our country. Jesus, look at that. Huge explosion. David, I'm sorry to interrupt you, but we're looking at live pictures of the Pentagon where there is billowing smoke. Mick Jim Miklaszewski just reported that he heard a, an explosion. And Hold right on. now. So the Pentagon got hit too? How didn't I know this? Now we're looking at an aerial view of the Pentagon. There are reports of the Pentagon. How did I not know this? The White House is being evacuated. Many of you are seeing now However, I'd be very, very cautious. This is just um, the World Trade Center. All of the airports across the country have been shut down. All flights have been canceled for another seven hours, which is about five o'clock Eastern time. And then we'll reignite oh, there. We'll man, take a look at what's going on after that. The probability of extension, as they call that, is high. Take two. Take two and two. One. This is as close as we can get to the base of the World Trade Center. You can see the firemen assembled here, the police officers, FBI agents, and you can see the two towers. Oh, it's a huge down. explosion now, raining debris on oh, all of us. God, get, get, away, get away, get away, get away. Wow. Just think of all the debris in a building that size. If you're anywhere near the bottom, you are in great danger. Think of all the glass that's going to be going flying. Oh, look at this. Looks like a tornado. Oh my god. Oh my god. Fucking Christ, God! Oh my god. I hope I live. I hope I live. It's coming down on me. Oh, look at all the debris. Look at all of this. Here it comes. I'm getting behind a car. Anthony, you okay? Yeah. Ordinary people are going about their business. So messed up. Can't see a thing, you know. Anything could be happening. tell you that I can't see that second tower but there was a cascade of sparks and fire and now this it looks almost like a mushroom cloud explosion this huge billowing smoke in the second tower this was the second of the two towers hit now this is a this is what it looked like moments ago <laughs> my god I mean, what happened like was it some of the support beams did they like what did they like what caused the building to just smash down like that because the plane hit it quite high up didn't it the uh, remains of a airplane crash over on uh, Lammersville Road and probably had a terrorist uh, bomb on board that blew up I uh, don't know anything more than that. That's what I heard on the scanner. I just saw the smoke come up and uh, the, the uh, explosion shook the house clear over here. And we are, what, 15 miles from Lambertsville. In Washington, there, has, there is a large fire at the Pentagon. The Pentagon has been evacuated. 
And there's, you can see, perhaps the second tower, the front tower, the top portion of which is collapsing. Good Lord. There are no oh words. My God. Jesus. It's like seeing, you know, Big Ben just crumble to the floor, you know. I wouldn't I wouldn't believe it. I wouldn't believe it. I'd think I was hallucinating or something. We have a report that a 747 uh, is down in Pennsylvania. And that remains unconfirmed at this point, and so we will check on that. Just wreckage. It, looks, it literally looks like a war zone. It looks like a war zone. Like the place got hit with a nuke. Good evening. Today, our fellow citizens, our way of life, our very freedom came under attack in a series of deliberate and deadly terrorist acts. Thousands of lives were suddenly ended by evil, despicable acts of terror. These acts of mass murder were intended to frighten our nation into chaos and retreat. But they have failed. Mm. Our country is strong. A great people has been moved to defend a great nation. The search is underway for those who are behind these evil acts. I've directed the full resources of our intelligence and law enforcement communities to find those responsible and to bring them to justice. We will make no distinction between the terrorists who committed these acts and those who harbor them. I can hear you! I can hear you! The rest of the world hears you! W. <laughs> George W. Bush. Soon. You're damn right. Wow. Crazy video. Incredible video. Wow, that video legit gave me goosebumps. I don't know if the camera can see, like, my hairs are standing up. It was just, it really changed the world, that event. It really changed a lot of things. You know, airport security went way higher, way higher. You know, it created, you know, a lot of conflict in the world. Just, I, it definitely felt like the world changed on that day. It's just, uh, it's crazy to think that people will go to such lengths, you know, over a set of beliefs. Like they will kill thousands over it. It's just, um, it's a shame. And those people that got, that lost their lives, you know, innocent, just like I mentioned at the start of the video, going to work, just, living you know walking around the city as i would you know you know in london just just going about my life and to think that they were just their lives were lost like that over something that they had nothing to do with you know such a shame such a tragic event that will be remembered for a extremely long time you know may the may those lost rest in peace thanks for watching guys and i'll see you in the next one